Can you simplify this fraction? 1,593 over 2,596. Hmm, large, large, quite large. By using which method can we succeed? Actually, there is a trick. It is called the Euclidean algorithm. Thank Euclid for the wonderful method. How does it work? For simplifying this fraction, we should firstly find the greatest common divisor of the numerator and the denominator. So now, let's find the greatest common divisor of these two numbers, these two huge numbers. Firstly, let's use this method this way. Now, do it this way. Mm. Compare the numerator with the denominator. Which one has the bigger value? Of course, the denominator. It is 2,000 something. However, the numerator is 1,000 something. So now, write the larger number here. 2,596. Then, divide this number by our numerator. 1,593. Then, we will get a quotient and a remainder. Our quotient is 1. Our remainder is, I'm going to write it here, 1,003. Now, compare our this divisor with this remainder. Which one has the bigger value? Of course, our divisor. 1,593. Then, let this number divide by our smaller number, our smaller remainder. Then, quotient is 1 and the remainder is going to be 590. Repeat this process. Compare these two numbers. Of course, our divisor 1003 is larger. So divide it by 590. It's going to be 1, and then the remainder is going to be 413. Then, Compare these two numbers, of course, 590 is larger, so let it divide by 413. The remainder is, we don't know, but the quotient is 1. 590 minus 413, it is 177. Then, 413 divided by 177. It is 2 remainder 59. Then 177 divided by 59. Quotient is 3 and the remainder is, you can find out that 3 times 59 is equal to 177. So that means the remainder is 0. If the remainder is 0, our process will be finished. So the greatest common divisor of 1,593 and 2,596 is 59. So now we can simplify this fraction. Write it here. Then, it is equal to 1,593 over 59, then divided by 2,596 over 59. Evaluate our numerator and our denominator. Then the numerator is going to be 27 and the denominator 44. That's our answer. That's the simplification. Did you get it? Only 4% people will subscribe to me. Are you one of the 4%? Subscribe to me. Give a thumbs up for the Euclidean algorithm. We'll see you next time.